Hey guys, festival season is upon us and I am ridiculously excited this year because with the new baby, if we didn't go to any last year, the year before that I was massively pregnant so we didn't go to any then either, but this year we are taking the toddler to his first festival. So if you are going to festivals, well here are my few festival essentials. So, first of all, I know this is optimistic, but we have to be realistic here. You're gonna need your sun cream. This is the one that I absolutely love. It's factor 15. This is the minimum you should be using if you're out in the day, if you've got fair skin. Think about factor 30 or factor 50. Now, I know this stands sounds like I'm your mum nagging you, but I'm right. We need to be using our sun cream. And this stuff is amazing. Literally, this isn't sponsored. This isn't an ad. I'm just in love with this sun cream. Look, it just goes on invisible and then rubs in like oil. But it's once a day and it's factor 15. So you're gonna need your sun cream. Dry shampoo, because nobody really, really wants to be queuing for hours to have a go on those manky, manky showers. So you're gonna need your dry shampoo because my hair needs a lot of doing. Um, yeah, my hair needs a lot of doing. So we're gonna need our dry shampoo. And because showers are gonna be manky, baby wipes. These baby wipes are just good for everything. Abs there's nothing that you, the baby wipes cannot clear up or tidy or fix. So get yourself a pack of baby wipes. I know this might seem weird you turning up to the festival with your friends, but a pack of baby wipes is absolutely essential. A really good scarf. This is my current favorite one. Look at how pretty and sparkly it is. This was absolutely I love this one forever 21 absolutely love it and scarves are so so useful you can just use them to put over your shoulders you can use them if you fashion emergency just make yourself a nice little top make yourself a nice little dress out of this if it is raining they will cover up your hair really really well cover up your shoulders and they're so small to pack you do not need an absolutely massive scarf they take up absolutely no room at all and can be used for so so many things now this is an essential for me but might be a slightly unrealistic essential for you because it, it was 40 quid so it's up to you but <clears throat> a solar charger so I'm, I'm planning on it being sunny at the festival I don't know what the weather is planning on doing but I'm planning for sun um, it was sports day yesterday, it was raining, but, you know, I I had my sun cream on, I had my glasses out, I was in my short dress and flip flops and I had my big straw hat on because I plan for sun. I'm an optimist. So, I've got my massive solar charger here in the back. Just like your um, USB plugs, put your um, USB chargers in there and everything is charged up, ready to go because... You know, the toddler wakes up really early, and if CBBS isn't on at the festival, which in reality it's not going to be, and nobody else is going to be awake at 6 o'clock in the morning, then I'm going to need some help. So I'm going to need to make sure my phone and my iPad are fully charged. You're going to need a good festival bag. Now, this is my festival bag. I love this bag. We have been through a lot together. We have been travelling together, we've been festivals together, we've done loads of gigs together. I love this bag, it is an awesome bag. One of the reasons it is a really good festival bag is because it has long straps, so I don't actually need hands to hold it. On the back it has a zip compartment that goes all the way down to the bottom, so it is really, really hard for anyone to get their hand in there and get stuff out when I'm not looking. In the front, it's actually quite a roomy bag. You can actually get quite a lot of stuff in there. I've done um, festivals where I've taken like, you know, good books with me to just, you know, sometimes you just want to sit around and lounge and read a book. Sun cream, this festival is going to be filled with nappies and baby wipes and water for the toddler. But a good festival bag is going to be so, so helpful. It needs to be something that is easy to carry around is safe or has safe compartments for you to store your phone, any cash, you know, whatever, 
and you can store a lot of stuff in there. So, good festival bag. A good book to read. Now, I am on a very, very different schedule to most of my friends these days. Um, we went to um, Valencia on Hindu and you know, I don't need one baby at the time. I was getting up at five, six o'clock in the morning because that's the time my body clock was waking me up and my friends were getting in at that time. So yeah, I'm old, I'm afraid, but you know, you're going to a restaurant, you're staying with friends, you've got different body clocks, different schedules. Maybe you just need some alone time to recharge yourself. So a good book is absolutely essential for the times when you wake up an hour for your friends or times when they want to go to bed at a different time to you or the times when, you know, you just want to go and sit under a tree by yourself and recharge for a little bit. I know I find that really, really important. Other things you are going to need for a festival is a mini first aid kit. Now, I haven't finished putting mine together yet, so I haven't got it ready for you here. But a few things you're going to need in your mini first aid kit. Painkillers. Because you might get a headache. From doing things that some of you are probably a little bit too young to be doing. You might get a headache. Um, so take some uh, ibuprofen or take some paracetamol. But be really careful. Don't take too many. Um, now, the toilets might not be very nice. So you might want to take some antibacterial wipes with you or some antibacterial hand spray so that you can wash your hands afterwards. Um, you're going to need to take some condoms with you because if you take them with you, you've got the chance to use them. If you don't take them with you, then you don't have a chance to use them. And if you take them and don't use them, well that's fine. Don't plan on using them, that's absolutely fine. But just take them so that you've got the option. Or be nice and give someone else the option. Maybe one of your friends would like to use them. Um, what else do we need on our mini first aid kit? Off the sun. Put something in there that is going to be good for um, burns, just in case you do burn yourself. Okay, guys, there we go. Those are a few um, festival essentials. The most important thing at a festival is to remember to stay safe. So, um, stay with your friends. Don't drink too much. Make sure to take water with you. Drink water. Um, don't go with people you don't know. Don't take any tablets because that's just stupid. Um, yeah, stay safe and have a good time. Let me know which festivals you go to, if there's anything else that other people should remember to take to festivals. And have a good summer, guys.